Okay. Okay, I'm gonna start. Okay, I'm gonna start. I'm starting. I'm gonna start. Any second now, I'm gonna do it. Okay. <laughs> quick self promo stuff um hi guys check out my discord channel enolia and friends for fun games and art related chat and advice i put the link in the description down below um hey guys check out my patreon i eat food will you please give me food i'm very hungry hey guys check out my i ran out of stuff never mind oh my god i hate the sound of my own voice how do YouTubers do this? Um, have you heard those videos with the robot voices? Like, I guess, like, anything is better than that. My dad watches a lot of those, like, Is Hitler living in Antarctica? Bush did 9-11. Is Adele a lizard person? Aliens stole our gold. There's tunnels under Walmart. Um, uh, yeah, those videos. And I swear they all have that really annoying computer-generated, like, voice thing. It's like nails down a chalkboard. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> okay, so the topic today is art block, because everybody else seems to be talking about it, so I'm gonna chime in. <laughs> this is a direct message to a lot of the members in my Discord, who are always feeling bad about their art, so they proceed to, you guessed it, not draw. That's bad. Bad, 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 bad. You can't do that. Now, art block isn't some diagnosable illness or anything. Uh, let me pull up a definition here somewhere. Writer's block, or art block, is a condition in which an artist loses the ability to produce new work or experiences a creative slowdown. So unless your hands are literally tied behind your back, I don't think you have actually lost the ability to create new work. <laughs> okay, so you're an artist, right? I'm assuming that's why you watch my videos. You've experienced the dreaded art block, correct? Basically, you lose all inspiration. Everything that comes out you that you draw is pretty much crap. You can't draw a single thing you put down on paper and your self-esteem has plummeted. Uh, yeah, been there, <laughs> done that. Well, what do you do when you have art block? What most artists do is they friggin' give up. They sit in their little bubble of self-pity and they don't realize that their art block is a result of something good. It means that you're improving. You can recognize the bad in your art, and therefore you're ready to improve. You must study if you are going to improve. I can't stress this enough. If you want to become a professional, if you want to make it in this world of competitive artistry, you're going to need to buckle down and get to work. Some days I look at my artwork and I think, oh my god, what the fuck. And other days I think, I'm the best and nobody can beat me, I'm going to rule the world, get good scrubs, fight me IRL. Yeah. Art block means you have improved, because you recognize your own mistakes. Once you fix those mistakes, you will have leveled up. <laughs> when you have art block, the worst thing you can do is stop drawing. Don't do that. Draw. Draw until it looks good. And if it doesn't look good, draw some more. Take a look at some tutorials on the internet. Learn some new techniques. Study areas that you're weak in. If you ain't drawing, you ain't clawing your way to the top, am I right? <laughs> Depression, alright. Let's say you really can't draw. You feel like it's not just your art, but everything sucks. You suck. You're developing negative feelings, not just towards your art, but the world around you is becoming gray and bleak. That's not art block, that's depression. And there are ways you can get help for that. Talk to your friends or peers or parents, or go to the doctor. I was in that boat, and I got help. The world can become beautiful and colorful again, I assure you. I don't regret getting help when I needed it. Art block can be a result of depression, so recognize the signs. Burnout. You've been going at it, and you've been going at it hard. Wink wonk. And all of a sudden, nothing looks good. You're tired, but you want to keep going. You think, maybe I've lost my talent as your hand shakes from all the coffee you've been drinking, and it's 4 a.m. <laughs> My friend, go to bed, get some rest, you've been working too hard. You need a couple days off to rekindle that fiery artistic spirit. Overworking is bad, okay? Art is a battle that never ends. 
The constant fight to understand how the world around us works in order to paint and maybe do it some justice. We can definitely feel like we're not good enough. Art block can come about from simply comparing yourself to others. Never, ever, ever do that. Have you ever watched Domix on YouTube? Does he do complex drawings? No. He does simple, cute drawings that tell a story. In art, it's the feelings conveyed that truly matter. If you are passionate, that will shine through. And when you are passionate, you will search for and thirst for artistic knowledge and actively seek it out wherever you can find it. Learn from your friends and always ask questions if you can. Without passion, you will never be a successful artist. And that is the cold hard truth. Keep at it, young Padawan. Daddy loves you. Whew. Thank you for watching, and if you liked the video, it'd be super swell if you hit that subscribe button. I'm thinking maybe I'll actually make videos every week or every two weeks. I'm still finding my groove. If you didn't like the video, slam that dislike button. If you did like it, show it some love. Got a question for me? Ask away in the comments down below, and I'll answer your questions in future videos. Thanks so much for watching, and be excellent to each other. Shout out to my patrons, Howly Z, Luna, Lupin Grey, and Mandrill Maniac. I love you guys. Bye.